Uh, David, I can totally agree with you on um, pretty much everything that you said in your video on the new MacBooks and the MacBook Pros. I mean, there's no doubt about it that they look great, um, especially the MacBook being aluminum. But as far as the MacBook Pro and the MacBook looking the exact same, pretty much, just differences in size and stuff, I don't, I don't like that. I think that when you see someone using a MacBook Pro, you should immediately be able to say, oh, well, that's a Pro machine. And, um, you know, when you see someone using a MacBook, you know, the same. The same. It's like, oh, that's just a MacBook. That's not a MacBook Pro. Um, as far as FireWire and such, uh, I don't use FireWire for much of anything. Um, I think I used FireWire 800 for my time machine backup at one point, but the location of it, it interfered with my mouse. But as far as the FireWire, uh, I don't know. I don't have a camcorder, so I'm sure for someone like you to hook up uh, like a, your camcorder or anything like that, I'm sure be be really important. And I had no idea that Apple um, invented FireWire. I had no idea of that, so I don't understand why they'd take take away their invention either. And uh, as far as the oh, you can use FireWire 400 with a uh, say not a lot uh, with an adapter. You know, it's all about getting that money for that, for that adapter, you know. And that's probably where they were going with it. But still, I agree, you, should, you shouldn't you should have to buy an adapter. You should be able to have a 400 and an 800. Um, definitely, as far as USB ports, you need to, more than two. Uh, I've got a built-in 7 port, and it's enough. <laughs> I mean, 7. And I use pretty much all of them with my... Uh, iPod and iPhone and all that stuff connected. You definitely need more than two. And as far as the glossy displays, I have a Santa Rosa MacBook Pro, the it's a matte screen, stuff like that. And I like it. You know, I've seen the glossy ones, the colors are more vibrant, they look good, you know, I but I don't like the reflections. I can't stand that either. You know, with the glossy screens, I mean I like the glossy screens, I'm not as adamant about getting rid of them as you are, but I'd prefer a matte, I'd use a glossy if you're using it in a place where you don't have a lot of reflections, like, you know, this window back here, um, I had to shut it because it completely screwed up the way the eyesight looked on my MacBook Pro here, and that would constantly be a huge reflection in the screen, like, right here, every time I used it, so... I agree with you on that. Um, no, that they look good. I like them. Just they need more separation between the pro, the pro laptop and the consumer laptop. And I don't know where they're going with it. Uh, the LED display, you know, the new cinema display, it looks looks great. But you know, I'd like to be able to use that with what I have, and I don't want to have to pay fifty dollars. I don't have much the adapters are. I don't want to have to pay for an adapter to be able to use it so and nine hundred dollars is extremely high for a display I mean, even even it's at even though it's apple you know you can get a 24 inch display for a couple hundred dollars cheaper from dell i think so it's just i don't know where they're going with it you know i'm like you i still like apple whatever but they need to get a handle on what they're doing for real. thanks